What up, y'all? It's your boy Fort Worth Fabian back with a video, man. I've been, you know, taking time up to just taking time out to chop it up with you guys and just talk. You know what I'm saying? And really, I kind of wanted to talk today about surrounding yourself with good energy, man. And um, you know, I just I really am talking about it today because I kind of encountered a scenario where you know I can. Me, I've always been like a real observant person, man. Like I've always been able to read uh, people. I've always been able to feel vibes, feel energy, and um, Maybe I brought this certain situation on myself, but, you know, I feel like I'm very just like misinterpreted, you know, misunderstood around people and people don't really see that. You know what I'm saying? What people want to see is that, you know, people want to take their own ideas and let their mind run away with their own thoughts about what somebody's doing or, you know, their own attitude. And, um, you know, to put that in better context, I would say, um, you know, I've always been like a real quiet dude, and sometimes I know how to pick and choose my words, and sometimes I feel like there's no need to speak at all. So sometimes I'll just walk into a room and just I'll sit, you know, I'll do what I need to do. But people around will take that as something's wrong or he doesn't like me or, you know, there's an issue, there's a problem. And uh, I never understood that, you know what I'm saying? Um, I've always saw people that who spoke too much as people that were the most insecure in the room. And they say the quietest in the room are usually the strongest, the leaders in the room. Because they don't need to, you know, spill, run at the mouth to make up for, you know, insecurities that they, they possess or whatever. I've always been the type of dude, just sit down, keep quiet unless it's necessary you know, and don't get me wrong. I like to joke and all that. I do all that too. I like to joke around and all that good stuff, man. But sometimes, like, I'm just on some real shit. Like, I don't, like, the small talk ain't there for me. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes I don't feel like small talking. And, you know, small talk has never been my thing. Small talk is just BS, man. It's never any anything genuine. A lot of people just small talk just to, you know, get a, get through the day or get past these next few minutes if you're sitting by somebody on the train or on a bus or and you know it's not real it's not genuine so why even participate i can say hi and bye i'm not gonna be rude to people you know i'm always greeting people and being nice to people but you know at times like i feel like people's negative energy just sucks it at sucks like my positive energy out of me and i just have some type of art and then it's gonna ch it changes my attitude and my perception on you and that's just i don't want that type of energy man and uh, i've really been a reflecting on um you know the laws of human nature you know you know the laws of the universe and all that you know and um i really been taking that into account and just like wanting to be positive and not associate with things that are negative but yeah man i feel like just being out here you know a lot of the relationships i build have kind of just fumbled and maybe that's me because sometimes it's not all fun and games for me. I don't always want to just be hanging out and playing around and doing shit. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes I'm just kicking it by myself, working on things. And, you know, to develop as a person, you need time for yourself. You need to be able to set aside time and not just party and bullshit all the time, you know? And um, I've definitely learned how to do that a lot more. And, uh, you know, the vibe I've just been feeling around people that I thought was people that I could fuck with is just that, like, people don't want to fuck with me. You know what I'm saying? So... It's not an issue with me. It's not an issue because that's not going to stop me from doing what I need to do in my life. That's not going to derail me. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm always going to do what I need to do at the end of the day. I'm focused on myself. You know what I'm saying? And uh, people I do what I'm doing this for. My why. You know, only I know that. And uh, I just feel like I can't associate with certain people because their energy is just so negative. Even if I come up to you and I'm just like, hey... And I even just had to start a conversation with you and shit like that. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm not going to get into particulars, but there's just certain individuals where I felt like no matter how much you try to put the best foot forward, to be kind hearted to them, to show them love, they will not, whichever way you rub them or they assume that you rub them, they'll take that as like a fuck you forever type shit. You know what I'm saying? Some motherfuckers just don't know how to forgive and forget. Me, I, I, I'm well aware of how, knowing how to forgive and forget. And, like, I try to be a better person each day. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to grow. I ain't trying to hold grudges. I ain't trying to just, like, be in high school, nigga. Like, we grown-ups. You know, this ain't no high school shit. You know, and um, some people just don't know how to communicate. And, uh, you know, if you have a problem with me, let me know. If there's an issue, say something. Because there's a lot of times where I am very um, vocal. Um, and what's the word? 
the word is, um, well, I'm very um, confrontational. You know what I'm saying? I don't care. Like, if there's a problem or I feel like there's a problem, I'm not afraid to address it. And it's not even in a negative manner. It's about putting all your cards on the table and resolving solutions. You know what I'm saying? They say communication helps, but a lot of people don't understand that. They're just too scared. So I just feel like, you know, there's some people that just ain't worth keeping around. You know what I'm saying? Like, all the best to you. I'll show you love and all that. And, you know, I'll say hi to you, but there's no point in having small talk with you because there's nothing genuine there. There's no point in asking you to hang out because you have some animosity towards me, no matter what I do, no matter if I apologize. And, um, you know, I, I just really can't associate with that no more. You know, I don't care. You know, I'm, all we can do, do what you can. And, uh, you know, what you can't control, leave it up to God. Leave it up to, you know, the universe is what I say. And, um, you know, I'm kind of going on this rant because that's how I feel. Like, I understand it, though. Like, I understand the game. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, just to all you out there, understand if you have toxic people in your life, if you got people that you know you can't surround yourself around because they bring you down and they got a negative attitude, they just can't clear the slate, they just can't think positively, there's always something in the back of their mind, you know what I'm saying? Stay away from the people, bro. Like, just do what you need to do um, because life's too short for all that, man. I'm, I'm, I I'm, want to spend time around people that actually enjoy my presence people that I actually can relate to, people that are like-minded like me, people that are chasing dreams, big dreams, big goals, because surround yourself with the people you want to be like. Surround yourself with the people who are in position that you want to obtain or reach one day. And, um, you know, I need to do more of that, and that's what I've been learning, man. All the small talk, people talking about nothing progressive. People ain't talking about getting no money. People ain't talking about advancing their life. People ain't talking about reaching new heights. You know what I'm saying? That's not a conversation I want to be a part of if it ain't about bettering me. So much love and respect to everybody, you know, just keep showing love to people even when they hate you. But at the end of the day, don't waste your time trying to salvage relationships when, you know, they're already out the window. You know what I'm saying? And there's nothing you can do to repair them. At that point, it's just out of your hands, yo. So salute to y'all. Take it easy. Much love, much respect. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, man. Follow me on Instagram at Fort Worth Fabian. And we out, man.